Everybody. We're here with Ana Maria Guiducci of the Museum in Siena that is putting on this exhibit on uh, the early Renaissance in Siena. Uh, what was the biggest challenge to organize this exhibit? Certainly the challenge was that we managed to involve and convince the museums, some of the most prestigious museums of the world, to permit us their loans. It doesn't often happen that one gets such a positive response. Over 70% of those museums asked did agree to loan their works. And this is a big success, also because Siena shows itself to be, at this point, in the eyes of our foreign museum colleagues, a center of excellence in the organization of major exhibits. My creature, or my pet, I permit myself to call it this, is a very large polyptych by Santi di Pietro, the Politico dei Gesuati of 1444. Not only big, but also greatly important. Important because it is the first work signed and dated by the artist. It is a kind of palimpsest of all the quality and organization required by Santi di Pietro and his workshop to create this scenographic piece, with use of precious materials like lapis lazuli, laca di garanza red, use of gold, of course, thus a veritable explosion of richness and aristocratic style that characterizes all of Siena's painting of the Gothic age.